Hey guys, basically welcome back to another YouTube video with Experience Subscribable. Basically, as you can see, I'm in a different t-shirt today. But anyway, man, I know you guys have been waiting at least over two months for me to upload a new video. As you guys know, anyway, I'm going to get into this video right about now to basically start talking about the possibly potential of the Logan Paul versus KSI or Jake Paul versus KSI, whichever one it is. And basically Deji as well, and also basically all some of the other undercards, I think. I'll have to have a look. Anyway guys, I'm going to get straight back to the video in 3, 2, 1. Hey guys, I'm basically back, and yeah, basically... Basically, what I think, KSI's got the boxing background, boxing figure. I know he's a white collar boxer at the moment. But I think, down to a T, he's going to have... I think it's Logan or Jake Paul beat at the moment. I've just researched it, but like saying, like saying, at the end of the day, I think KSI is gonna gonna come out anyway. And for Deji, I'm sort of like half and half on it. I think one of the Paul brothers is basically gonna beat him. No offense to Deji, I know he's a brilliant YouTuber. At the end of the day, but like saying though, some of that. MMA stuff because it's mixed martial arts basically it'll come into effect with boxing so basically because it's in a boxing arena if it is if it's in a mixed martial arts arena basically it's going to be a lot different for Deji a lot different for KSI basically it's going to be a lot more physical more demanding more stress more power more energy a lot of stuff like that basically will go in and also, they'll have sponsors, they'll have money situations, stuff like that. And basically, they're bringing them with Jake Paul and Logan Paul off, saying basically they have to pay about 500k into it. Basically, the winner, the loser, basically has to give it to charity, or basically the other one takes it away from them. Basically, I think that's just a bit, not saying I would actually reckon that with the charity bit. But at the end of the day, it's up to KSI and Jake Paul what they want to do. Basically, for all proceedings go to charity, that would be a brilliant idea. Which I won't mind. I like saying, guys, I'll just be back in a minute. Good afternoon to the toilet. Hey, guys, I'm back. Basically, anyway, with the, back to the situation in hand, anyway, basically, the KSI and Logan Paul situation. Basically, there's, like I've already said, there's going to be a lot of physical and demanding stuff. Basically, I hope then the day. KSI and Deji do win, but like saying at the end of the day for Deji, he, he needs a lot more training, he needs a lot more, I can about a lot more confident in his punches, a lot more tactic, being a bit more tactical, finding out where they're going to strike, where he's going to move, where he's going to block, where he's going to hit, so basically land that KO blow like KSI did to Joe Weller, basically no offense to Joe Weller, you, you did get your ass kicked in the last round. Basically that fight against KSI. I'm sorry, but it has to be said. I'm not being nasty or old, but like saying you are basically KSI and Joe Weller are two brilliant YouTubers. They've got their own books. They've got their own merchandise. Basically, which basically is a decent thing to do. Decent way to bring money in for people, but basically bring money in for the YouTubers. Also, because the side man, there's merch off that as well. Anyway, if like saying if Bazinga's like saying I know Bazinga's versing. Um, Basically, the how can I put it? The fat guy from Team Ten, but <laughs> he's not in Team Ten anymore by the look of it, I think. But anyway, like saying, if it does happen, I hope Bazinga comes out on top of that because, like saying, he's a brilliant YouTuber. He deserves, how can I put it? He deserves to be on the card. He's basic. He's got a decent fan base. Loads of loads of a load of other YouTubers and subscribers love him. It they love. I can put it. They love his mer merch. They love his content. They love everything. I love everything about him. Also, if like saying if, for instance, I know, Joe Drizzle doesn't like fighting. Like saying it would be nice to see him in a ring, but like saying as he said in one of the videos, he does not want to do boxing, as he's already said. There's also Mini Minter. Like say I I love to see him in a ring versus another YouTuber. For instance, Josh, Vic, Mr. Big Swans to Free Zerka, basically all the other YouTubers in that. 
like saying I'll leave a well like saying I know I'm rambling on but anyway guys I'll leave a link in the description for their merch website basically for the sidemen also for Joe Weller the Paul Brothers and anyway guys basically I'm just doing this because it's basically my opinion on the situation anyway like saying guys if you, like saying if you disagree just leave a comment and I'll get back to you if you don't agree with what I've said or if you do agree with what I've said like saying though hands down back to the first bit I said previously in this video is basically hands down I hope KSI wins the fight against Jake Jake Paul and I think it's Logan I think it's Jake Paul that's going against Deji come to shorts gamer like saying hoping these two YouTubers can get together like saying hoping KSI and, and Cover shorts game, aka JJ uh, Olatunji and Deli Olatunji, Deji Olatunji, and come out on top. Anyway, guys, I'll sign off now because this video is getting way too long now. Anyway, guys, I'll see you around. Bye.